Welcome to the virtual office training. Today we will learn how to create PO purchase order in Microsoft Excel. Just go to the file new on office template search box just type purchase order and press enter it will show the different type of purchase order. Just click one of them and press download. And it will show the purchase order on Excel. Just change the logo of your company here. Right click, change picture, and select the company logo and insert. It will show the company logo here. Which is your company name? Just type the name of your company suppose your company is computer world and you if you have any slogan just type here and if you don't know just remove it and type the address of your company, city, phone number and email here. If you have any PO number, just type the PO number and date is automatically display the two date because here is a function of today and today is 27 number, it will display the 27 number date and if you have any customer ID, just type and if you don't know just remove it just type the name of the vendor company name uh, street address uh, and city and phone number here vendor name is uh, Shiraz and company is RES and type the address of uh, these companies and so on and type the city and type the phone number here and where you want to ship this product just type the name of the company name of the person company name address and so on city and phone number here and shipping method if you have any shipping method by air by uh, bus by train just type the shipping method and shipping term if you have any term then you you uh, you have to type here and delivery date here i have i want to purchase some lcd just type the quantity here item number and lcd what is the item lcd and unit price of LCD is 8,800 dollar and it will calculate uh, the amount automatically because uh, if you multiply this amount of uh, this quantity to the unit price then it will display the total amount and subtotal is if you 
have another item just type the quantity suppose we have purchase we have to purchase 25 keyboard and amount is $100 then it will display the total amount and it will automatically calculate the total amount here subtotal is here and total amount is not displayed just double click here it will display the amount and if you have any cell tax just type here 400 cells uh, for example cell tax is five percent and it will uh, calculate the five percent here and total amount is forty four thousand six hundred twenty five cell tax is five percent and total amount is here just type the uh, remaining option remaining uh, field here and your PO will be created and looks like here just uh, click the preview button you can see the PO here and there is a, some missing word here go to the page uh, go to the view and select the page break preview and drag it to this here and now you can see the complete PO here and you can print by click here hope this tip will be very helpful for you thanks for watching